Ethiopian soldiers were seen retreating from Tigray's regional capital of Mekele. As of Monday, rebel forces of the country's former governing party declared they had taken back control of the city. For its part, the Ethiopian government did not confirm reports that its soldiers had pulled out, but said it had declared a ceasefire to give farmers time to harvest their crops until the season ends in September. The Ethiopian military has occupied the Tigray region since November, after being ordered by Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed to retake control from the regional government. The conflict has spiraled into a civil war, which has killed thousands. Last Tuesday, an airstrike from Ethiopia's military hit a busy market in the Tigrayan city of Togoga, killing at least 64 people. Meanwhile, the human crisis is hard to fathom. The UN says more than 5 million people in Tigray are in urgent need of food, and U.S. officials have estimated some 900,000 people are facing famine. In the face of what is the world's worst hunger crisis in a decade, Prime Minister Abiy has denied that there is any hunger at all in Tigray.